Hey everyone, welcome to my video. With budget builds for easy to get arena bonus heroes, this time we have 4, Spring Loki from the Tempest Trial, Janke from Grand Hero Battle, Okuma from the 3 and 4 star summoning pool, and the free hero Alphonse. I already did one of these for Alphonse and one for Janke, so you can find them here. Spring Loki is a colorless flying archer. She has okay attack, good speed, and mediocre defense and resistance. She comes with Beginning Bow, with effectiveness against flying heroes, and granting plus 2 to every stat as long as the enemy is at full health. She also comes with Luna, Flyer Formation, and Goat Flyers. Loki is a great aggressive hero, with the potential to deal high amounts of damage. Keep her weapon with the Speed Refinement, give her Drawback or Reposition, you can keep Luna, or give her Moonbow or Glimmer for more special triggers. For the A slot, you can go for Life and Death, for a glass cannon build, or Fury for more chunkiness and synergy with Desperation. So, swap her B slot for Desperation, and give her this skill or give her a more appropriate buff. For the Seal slot, you can use Attack Speed Bond for a fully aggressive build, or if you prefer a more safe route, you can use Attack Defense or Speed Resistance Bond, or Brazen Attack Re Defense or Attack Resistance if you're using Fury. Lucky is a great unit this season. She have no problem killing most heroes but she'll need some help to deal with high defense distant counter enemies. Okma is an infantry red sword user. He has good attack and speed, mediocre defense and awful resistance. He comes with the legendary Gladiator's Blade with the heavy blade effect. He also comes with noon time, defiant attack and spore attack. Okma is also a pretty decent aggressive hero. He is really similar to Lucky but infantry. He wants basically the same build too but preferring Dragonic Aura or Luna for the special. You'll have to keep him safe from magic heroes though, as his resistance really is awful. He's a lot better with a high investment build, as his weapon allows him to run pretty strong Gale Force or Wrath builds, but he's still okay in a bot yet. That was it for the video, thank you so much for watching, please consider subscribing, liking and sharing, it always helps me, and feel free to leave a comment. Here you can check out my schedule for the week. And here you can find some of my other videos, or you can go to my main YouTube page where I have everything organized. I really hope you enjoyed, and see you next time!